Well, it's a three-day workshop focusing on master planning for a site down near the waterfront. This afternoon, we're going to be asking uh, both Peter and Alan uh, to, as it were, set the context for uh, this particular development. Dundee is going through a tremendous change. Uh, in terms of the Dundee waterfront, which I'm particularly concerned with, there's potentially up to £1 billion pound to investment in the next 20 years. Uh, not only is that going to create new jobs, it's also going to create new leisure opportunities, new housing, uh, and a whole series of new environments that people can enjoy. We've come and um, not just lectured at students but spent a couple of days trying to um, do proper master planning. I prefer to get the students engaged in doing it themselves because it's the fastest way to learn by far and walking them round towns or streets or squares that, and, and just opening their eyes to the kind of sheer wisdom and knowledge that is embedded in all of that stuff. It's almost like making a cake and it's finding the right ingredients and finding the right methodology and how you put it together. It's, it's, it's so many different things and layers of information and layers of design and that all have to be integrated and synthesized to make, uh, to make the master plan. It's really good working in the team I think because you're able to bounce ideas off each other. <laughs> It's not just about the waterfront as we are talking about, it's about the whole of Dundee. But, but even the fact that the railway line is all there and it's running is complementary to the fact that it's all railway yards and things. For me, it's a good new concept, it's just, just offering. What I'd like to do is pin up all the work in three sections along that wall from one side to the other. Urban planning. Um has such a low profile of being an important job, but actually it shapes the places where people live. I think all credit to Dundee University for actually taking the time to bring people in to the university to support their studies. It's a place you can do things in, and, and, and I think that You've got the feet, you've caught the corners of it, you know, simplicity of frame. I think in terms of urban design, um, what you've come forward is a lot better than what we're going to do. I think it's first class, um, just studying the facilities, um, the campus buildings, everything's close together, everybody's very friendly. I think it's greatly located for planning students and architectural students and urban designers and urbanists and everybody to, uh, to get stuck into thinking about the long-term future of our great cities. <laughs>